You're looking at China's brand new AT200 drone, large enough to deliver a small car. It's nearly 12 meters long, can fly more than 2,100 kilometers at a time, and cruises around at 313 kilometers per hour. But what makes it really special is its ability to carry cargo weighing one and a half tons. This month, it took off on a test flight from northwest China's Shaanxi province, just its second public flight. In this control station, we can carry out the drone's one-click landing, which is to click once, and then the drone can independently complete the entire process, from climbing and cruising to landing. In the future, the drone has to be equipped with an air traffic response device, so that air traffic controllers will know exactly where the plane is located in real time. The AT-200 is being developed by the Chinese Academy of Sciences. Researchers spent 17 months transforming it from an ordinary small plane to an unmanned cargo aircraft. There is still a long way to go in the future, which is to take off and land at different types of airports, such as hard dirt roads, grasslands, and airports located at high altitudes. The drone should adapt to all of these. The AT-200 could soon join delivery drones in the sky from companies like Chinese e-commerce giant JD.com. It's working with the Chinese Academy of Sciences to test unmanned drones capable of carrying packages and other goods. The hope is to fly these drones into remote parts of China, bringing down the price of goods in faraway places like Xinjiang. What's more, goods produced in these remote regions could more easily get to bigger cities. And as transportation costs go down, so do prices consumers will pay. We are working with local governments and farmers and have already set up scores of production bases for fruit and other agricultural produce around the country. We want to build competitive agricultural brands in each region. Branded products sell at a premium, and when farmers earn more money, they are more willing to grow safer and higher quality produce. In this way, the whole chain will enter a virtuous cycle. This year's China Agriculture and High Tech Fair featured nearly 80 drones designed for farming applications. Drone pesticide sprayers got a lot of attention. The drones automatically detect how much pesticide is needed, then spray with accuracy down to millimeter levels.